Hi guys and welcome to my unboxing of my PS4. It's just arrived to arrived today. Uh, I'll tell you what I've got. I've got the PS4 Slim 500 gig. I was going to get the Pro, but when I read up on it, it's basically pointless unless you've got a 4K TV. And well, I don't have a 4K TV. I just have like a 55 inch LED 3D TV downstairs and then upstairs for where I do my gaming and that. I just have a regular 37 inch uh, Samsung LCD screen basically. Uh, so I didn't see the point in spending the extra and getting the Pro. So yeah, without further ado, let's crack on and show you what I got and what you get inside. First off, the game that I got was Horizon Zero Dawn. I have liked the look of this game. Uh, it did look good when I seen the adverts for it on TV. I'll get into it. <laughs> but on, only because the adverts look good doesn't mean the actual game is good. With the PS4 as well, I'm going to be doing some multiplayer with my, my girlfriend, um, wait, partner, soon to be wife. We will be doing uh, Crash Bandicoot, which is one of the reasons why I got the PS4 when the remastered version of that comes out of all three games. I'll be doing that as well. So here's the game box without the cover on. See a lot better. It's a nice cover like this is a PS4 like PlayStation exclusive. It's the back of it. I do like the look of it like oh, let's see what Oh it's got a nice uh art on the back. Obviously, you, people who have a PS4 and have already got this game up. Not everything that you get inside, but I thought I'd just do my take on it and what I've got. So that was the game. Next off is another wireless controller. It's a proper official one. And that, uh, Aftermarket crap. Get open. <clears throat> right. Here we go. Nope, and I've just brought the box. Obviously, most of you know of the PlayStation 4 controllers, but this is it. It's pretty decent, it's nice, small, light. I haven't held a PlayStation controller since the PS2. <laughs> well, that was a long time ago. Oh, that feels good, feels nice in your hands. I don't know if I prefer this more over the Xbox One controller. Mm. Let's see what this one's like. Right, here we are getting into the actual PS4. Up. 
it's on the box. It's VR ready. I will be getting the VR, just not yet. The VR is my main thing. I was going to buy both together, but it's not cheap. <laughs> there if you want to read it. Right. Oh, that's a lot lighter than I thought it would be. Save the juicy bit. After. This is it. And we've got PlayStation Protect Policy. Love your PlayStation 4. Mm. Three 12 months warranty, I'll be uh, taking that out. Looks like we opened up the wrong way around. Yes, I did. Right. Uh, here we go. We've got. Looks to be the controller charger. And what the hell is that? I mean, is that what they call a headset these days? At least with the Xbox One, you got a decent, a somewhat of a decent starter headset. I mean, that's pathetic. I know everyone just doesn't use them anyway, but still, it's obviously power cable. Pamphlet, another pamphlet, and another pamphlet. There's your HDMI cable. That's obviously the controller as well. laid out. So here's the juicy bit. It's the actual console. It's nice and small and I used to, I did have a, ooh. right, I did have a PlayStation 3 years ago and oh, I haven't half changed the design on these. That's the top. Just zoom out a bit. That's the top. It's one side. It's the back. That's the front, as you can see. You've got the USB, and then it's where your CD ROM drive goes. And you've got the bottom. Oh, it's a nice little touch. The little X, circle, triangle, square. Like on the controller. So yeah, it's, it's just a short video. 
that's basically my PlayStation 4 unboxing. Thanks very much for watching and hope to be hopefully be uploading some footage of this game and hopefully more. Cheers for watching, thanks, bye.